Hey y'all, it is fall in the south. Well, at least it's fall in my house, even though fall is not for a couple of weeks, but I am so excited to be decorating for fall, finally. I felt like I have been waiting for this moment for the entire time that I got my house. <laughs> Um, but I am using a lot of decorations that I had previously in my old house and I am using decorations that I got from the Dollar Tree and Michaels today. So I hope that you stay tuned. Make sure that you like and subscribe this, to this video or to my channel and let's get started. So the leaves that are sitting on top of my mantle, I had those previously from my old house but I'm almost positive I got those from Michaels because I saw them when I went today and right now Michaels is um, allowing everyone to get 40% off of all their fall decor so make sure that you go check that out. So if you've seen a lot of my previous videos, then you know that I um, already have that basket sitting on top of my fireplace and I'm just going to utilize what I've got. I bought a really pretty white pumpkin that you're about to see in the next clip and I am going to put that pumpkin inside of the basket and set like one of the pillows that I've already had from a while back on top to just kind of give it some dimension and some color and I'm going to put the blanket on the basket as well and then this pumpkin that I am lighting up right now I got that from Hobby Lobby last year I believe and the lantern all I did to the lantern was I put some pine cones in it along with um, just some pumpkins and I think like some squash or whatever <laughs> And I just kind of did that up a little bit. If we only could talk just a little Find a place where the past is forgiven You moved on, I am stuck in the middle Tried to run, but there's nowhere to go Breathing in my sleep I'm calling out your name So the tape that you see on my drawer is because Garrett likes to open the drawers so uh, I gotta make sure that he doesn't pull it out on top of them so we taped it. But I have these cute little bowls that we got from Hobby Lobby and they're just leaf bowls and I put those on the end tables. Um, this centerpiece that you see that is going on my island used to go on the dining room table and I put that on my island just because. I am doing something else with my dining room table and that fit perfectly there. 
So I'm clearing off everything. This is the table or the little, I guess, china cabinet that is in my dining room. I'm clearing all of the pictures off of it and I am going to put what used to be on my dining room table on top of this and I'm adding just some decor that I had from around the house and then I will be decorating the dining room table in something completely different. Sometimes I wish that I never met you It's so hard, so damn hard to forget you And no words could explain how I miss you So I was inspired by Pinterest for this dining room table. Um, I got a lot of different Pinterest ideas but I went to the Dollar Tree and everything that you see on this table has come from the Dollar Tree except for the two lanterns. I got those at Michael's and they were on sale. Um, they were $10 a piece and then I got one of them for 50% off so I mean I got both of them for 15 bucks. You can't beat that at all. Um, but anyway, everything, like I said, is, is from the Dollar Tree on this table. The um, scarf <laughs> is actually one of my scarves from fall, and I'm just using it as decor. And I am just going to spruce up the table a little bit with different things. I do a little mini DIY project, which I'll show you in a later clip. But other than that, I um, put some leaves that I got from the Dollar Tree inside the lanterns and I also found which is really cool I also found some light up leaves oh those candlesticks are not from the Dollar Tree those were some that I had previously on my dining room table um, but anyway I found some light up LED leaves and I put those inside the um, lanterns as well So this is the mini project that I did. I got four candlesticks and I know that I'm sure a lot of you have seen these in previous videos or you've done it yourself, but I just spray painted the candlesticks. I turned one of them upside down and I used E6000 to glue them together and then I got some little saucers from the Dollar Tree and I glued them to the top and I made like little platters and then I put pumpkins on top. Now I was supposed to have two the same size, but knowing me, how I'm super clumsy, I dropped one. So one is tall and the other is short. But I don't think it really matters because there's really nothing on my centerpiece that is, 
I guess, precise anyways. So if it doesn't match, whatever, it still looks good. <laughs> You gotta listen up, listen up There's not a thing that I can't get from you Boy, I don't need that much, need that much How can I tell you what I wanna do? I never needed you to give me thanks I never needed gifts or diamond rings All I ever need, I... So this is the finished look I love the way that it turned out. Once again, the Dollar Tree came through for me, like it always does. <laughs> um, but I hope that you enjoyed this video, and if you got inspired for fall, let me know. And it is definitely not too early to go ahead and start decorating your house, so you go for it. Um, but anyway, make sure you subscribe again, like this video, and I will see you in my next one. Bye! Hold it tight, hold it tight